Now let us understand how the competition took place between British and French. The Portuguese and Dutch had withdrawn from India unable to face the competition from French and English by 18th century. Finally, French and English continued to show strength in order to establish their political supremacy over India. Meanwhile, political changes raised in the regions of Hyderabad and Karnataka and both the English and French tried to make good use of the situation in their favor. This led to three Carnatic Wars. On the request of Dupleix, Le Bourdonnais, a French military leader from Mauritius, invaded Madras and captured it. This forced the helpless British to request the help of Anwaruddin, the Nawab of Carnatic, for support. The army sent by Anwaruddin failed to defeat the French at Madras. Finally, Le Bourdonnais took money from the English and returned Madras and went back to Mauritius. This made Dupleix angry and attempted to take Madras but failed in it. Finally, this war ended with a treaty in Europe between France and England called Treaty of Aix-la-Chapelle. Now let us see what happened in the Second Carnatic War which took place between 1749 to 1754. In the changed circumstances, French made Salabad Jung, another son of Asaf Jah, as the Nizam of Hyderabad. An officer named Basi was posted in Hyderabad for his protection by French. In Carnatic, Chanda Sahib was a Nawab with the help of French. Robert Clive of East India Company attacked Arcot, the capital city of Carnatic, and defeated Chanda Saheb. Chanda Saheb was imprisoned and later killed in this war. In the place of Chanda Saheb, the English named Muhammad Ali, the son of Anwaruddin, as the Nawab of Carnatic. The Second Carnatic War ended with the Treaty of Pondicherry. French called Dupleix back. This war brought laurels to English while French suffered a political setback. Now let us understand what happened in Third Carnatic War which took place between 1756 to 1763. Comte de Lally, the French general, tried to occupy St. George Fort of British in 1760. In this critical battle, Sir Ayer Court of the British Army defeated the French and imprisoned Bussy. After the attack, Lally escapes and tried to hide in Pondicherry. Finally, Sir Ayer Court attacked Pondicherry and Lally had to surrender unconditionally in 1761. After Carnatic Wars, French had to lose all their bases in India due to Carnatic Wars. In spite of this, as per the Treaty of Paris in 1763, Pondicherry was returned to French. With these developments, French lost their importance in India. Like this, English, by defeating all their rivals, started uniting their power over the southern India. Mm -hmm.